Hi guys, so yes, my star is missing from the top of this. I'm gonna have to remake my decals, TBH. But today we are going to be redoing my binders, reorganizing them because honestly, I really don't like how they look and I want the backs to be displayed and like, I don't know. I just wouldn't want to change up. And just like as a shout out, um, Honeydew Emoji recently did a video like this. Um, and also, you know, like Trade Petals is like the OG, like for cute binders. Like seriously, like they are the biggest inspiration, honestly. So anyways, let me just show you what I'm working with so I can kind of explain like what I want to change because, oh my God. So this is this is my ultimate binder it is my nct binder and bts binder and basically what i got working with is this i left the first pages so y'all could see but basically i'd have like fillers and then even for the nct i put like um fillers behind the cards and like that's cute like color coding them but like i want the backs to be displayed and like for it to look pleasing to the eye like honestly like especially for bts i hate having i talked about this in my organizing and storing my photo cards video but i hate having like these are four versions of love yourself her and then this one random like tier version is sitting here so like i really like don't like having one random card from a different version on a separate page from like the other four versions and also like having mark cards like his cards are really weird because he's in dream and one two seven or he was in dream but i mean you know politics but anyway he has like some dream cards and he has some like 127 cards and then 2018 cards and just like a whole mess so i would really like to or reorganize these cards by like just how they look and like you know just somewhat albums but also like based mostly based on how they look so i have set aside I took out all of Kuhn's cards, but I have set aside all the other cards um, that I have for these two guys. And I'm going to be doing my other binders like this as well for like what groups I can. But I'm going to start with BTS and NCT today. And so I'm going to take out these cards real quick and we can get started. Oh, also I forgot to mention that I am going to be adding some cards to my binders in these videos just so I don't like have to worry about reworking like a page in a later video. I'm also going to be adding some cards, but I don't have a lot right now. First, we're going to be starting with Yoongi. Now, these are all of the Yoongi cards I have currently and so I just, I kind of want, so, so I kind of want the Love Yourself Her series to like be J Chillin um, on its own because there's four versions and three series, three in the series. So they're probably gonna get their own pages. And then Yoongi, so I'm missing his Oh Are You Late 2 card. And I've made like little, like little like filler thing, but I do have the group card for that. So I think for this page, I'm gonna do like two, 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 because both Oh Are You Late 2 and Dark and Wild have group cards. And then we'll just like throw in You Never Walk Alone and Most Beautiful Moment in Life part one pcs or part two pcs because the other card the other earlier albums have like gigantic cards so we're just gonna like like see how this looks <laughs> i'm not really sure what i'm doing i just know that i want it to be cute and then we put this here and i like the whole like like trade pedals has a whole video on their channel about like how they pick out their like pages and stuff and i've watched that video like multiple times like to like get inspo and stuff so um i really like the two 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 pattern because it's just like very dynamic and pleasing to the eye i guess and then here this is the group card and i always have my group cards in like horizontal cards facing this way and I'll probably speed up parts of this just so y'all don't get bored of me just like putting cards in <laughs> the freaking binder. Okay, so this is what I have planned for this page. And then the rest will be like Love Yourself. The albums with like four versions. Like these albums don't have versions for their photo cards. So that is why they are all together. So this is the next page. And this is going to be, okay. We have, this is all Love Yourself, Her, with our blue Yoongi. So what I'm thinking is we have, since Yoongi has the same hair color, basically in Tear and Answer, 
we'll probably put these eight on the same page and then these four on a page because I want to save space while still having like nice looking pages. So because he has a different color hair, I kind of want to keep these guys together and keep dark haired Yungi like together, if that makes sense. This is kind of like what Ava explains in their videos. Like they look at the card and they look at like how, like, how it looks. So like he's wearing the same outfit in these two cards. So I would want them near each other. The whole thing is like this card has like a crazy background and this card has like a very blank background. So I'd want this card like kind of close to these cards and then this card, I don't know, you'll just have to see. So like, and I'm still like reusing my fillers that I had before. So this is a easier way to like not have to make more fillers. Even though this is like still a pattern background, it's still kind of like a plain background. So since this is a dark background, but also he's wearing the same outfit, and then this is a dark background and a light background, we're gonna put like these two close together and these two close together. And so we would do like here, 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 and here. So like these are still light and then these are still next to each other. Or we could also do dark background across from dark background and then light background across from light background. And I think that looks really nice because he's still wearing the same outfit is still next to each other. And like also you have the reds that kind of like go with each other here, but it kind of like, I don't know, it brings it all together, I guess. <laughs> but yeah, I really like how this looks. So I'm gonna... I think this is such an interesting way of like organizing your binder and like thinking about like how the photo card actually looks as opposed to like chronological order. It's very like, it's a nice way to be creative with your collection, I think. And I, so yeah, I think this looks very pretty to me. Okay, and then we're gonna move on to, what are these called? This is Love Yourself, Her, and Tear together. So, okay, so these four are Tear. No, wrong. These four are Answer, and then these four are Tear. And this is horrible. <laughs> because these all look kind of the same except for this one and like these all look kind of similar except for this one what are you doing big hit and also for the eight pattern we're just gonna have the center blocked out and you know that's kind of like it's kind of weird because like you would want the center point to have something filled but i don't know i think with these cards it's kind of okay and i could always write like love yourself tear and answer like here like just to fill it but there's really no way other way to do it and how i look at it for the eight pattern is like you have these four sections and then these four sections will be like tier will be here and then answer will be here it's just a matter of looking at what cards like look good together since like these three and these three have very similar color palettes like they're all kind of like pinky reds i kind of want them to be near each other and then these two are really weird ones. So um, they're gonna be near each other or like they're gonna be opposite each other. So they'll still be in there four and four. But it's a matter of putting them places. And you don't wanna break off the pinkies, the pinky hues, I guess. So you want the pinky hues to be like near each other. I'm gonna try putting the weird cards like in the corners and <laughs> see what it looks like. Oh, also another thing I didn't mention was, okay, so so like you have this card is obviously not a selfie and then we have a selfie card and then we have another selfie card and then like these four obviously not selfies so you want the non-selfies to like be in somewhat across from each other like it just draws it all together i don't know go watch i'll link trey piddle's video in the description and like in the pinned comment because just so y'all can see like their thought process because it's i understand it but i don't know how to explain it <laughs> I really like how this looks what my thought process is for this one is we have the two weird ones that don't really match the other concepts and then we have the two selfie cards like across from each other and then the weird ones are across from each other and then we have the four non-selfie cards like near each other and like these are all kind of like lighter cards and then these are like darker cards but yeah i'm gonna put them in their slot Okay, yeah, 
and that is the completed page for tier slash answer and now we have and the thing is is that the this set doesn't have a weird random card like this set does so i think i'm just gonna do four and four pages um and hopefully their next comeback they'll have like something i can pair with these ones because i don't want to like waste pages with these ones it's kind of like this random one is like just jay chillin so like i don't know what i'm gonna do with that <laughs> but let me just space out so i think i'm so this one's kind of like an oddball so I think I'm going to put this oddball and this oddball next to each other or across from each other. And then these two together like this. So it's like pinkish selfie with this pinkish weird one and across from another selfie. So yeah, that is the completed page. And next we're going to be doing another four square one. Okay, so thank God these are all selfie ones. But now I have to figure out what to do. Okay, so I think this is how I'm gonna do it because so we have the two smiling ones across from each other and then the two kind of like pouty faces across from each other. And then these two are lighter colors and these two are darker colors. And then we have the three light or three dark backgrounds next to each other and the one random light ones over here. I think that looks nice. Okay, so that's Yoongi done because his other stuff is like bigger things and I think I'm just gonna keep it how it is okay so Mark has a freaking bunch oh my god he has so many cards because he only has and don't even get me started about the freaking circle cards okay so I think what I'm gonna do after much contemplation is put his dreamy cards with his technically these are NCT 2018 cards and not 127 cards I think I'm going to put these all together and then have his NCT 127 cards without circle cards on one page and then put, deal with the cards with circle cards on their own pages. And I think we can just do six card pages and have that cute little pattern. I like to do it these two, these two, and these two. That's the completed page. I think that looks quite nice. For this page, let me put in my fillet. so cute okay and now we have to deal with the circle hearts friends my whole thing okay let me just take you through my journey here <laughs> so this is the new album um which is the repack so these are final round this is superhuman and then these are neozone cards pcs but the thing is is neozone has three versions they they have the N, C, and T version. I don't have his T version card, so I have fillers, like, spaces made for those. But I don't want to split up, do the three Neo versions, and then I guess put these all on one page, even though Superhuman came out before Neo Zone. That's just, I mean, that's what we're going to have to do, man. Okay, and then I have his things. 
So the circle card will be going here. I really need to buy it, but nobody has it. And I'm really sad about it. And I keep trying to buy from this person, but they're not answering me. And I'm really sad. Okay, so that's for this is the Neo Zone page. And then we're just gonna put everybody else on this page. <laughs> That's this page. I think it looks cute. Okay, never mind that superhuman is literally not supposed to be here, but it's beautiful anyway. I still love him. Okay, and then we have, this is his Super M collection. I don't know if they're ever gonna have any more albums, to be honest. <laughs> so um, I'm pretty happy with how it is right now. I'm not too worried about getting his Korean cards for this album because they look basically like this one other than filling up the page more, but I'm not too pressed about it currently. And then this is his postcard, and I actually have Kuhn's postcard now to put in here. So this symbolizes, even though it's much smaller than Mark's postcard, <laughs> um, this symbolizes the move from Mark's collection to Kuhn's collection because Mark obviously can't be in Wavy, so we, we collect in my man Kuhn's because I love him. And he actually doesn't have too many cards. So these two are NCT 2018 cards. And then he, the rest is like, this is Takeoff. And then this is Take Over the Moon. And then this is Take Over the Moon sequel. And he does have, their new album is out now. And that has two versions. So it has two circle cards and two regular PCs, but I don't have that yet. so. Um, I'm gonna have to wait to like set up a page, but I think that'll be its own page considering they're, they're two versions from the same album, so. his page um i do have a filler for him i use a dark green for him because um it's just like because he because wavy is like a part of nct but you know it's it's different okay and look at those pretty backs that's what i'm talking about and then that's it for this binder okay so now we're gonna start do this other banner i don't think i'm gonna have too much to change in this to be honest um but let's just take a look so i already went ahead and took out the fillers from this just so like you can see the bags on them because they're beautiful <laughs> i think i'm gonna like rearrange these because like you have like i don't know let me just rearrange them because there's too much horizontalness happening on this on this end and i really really miss cix and i really really want them to have a comeback and i need jin young to get better because <laughs> i want to come back so bad i'm so hyped for their comeback and then it was like, hey, <laughs> Jin Young's injured. And I was like, why? Why? And then that was like not too soon after we had, uh, learned about Hua's in injury. And I was like, no, 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 you don't need to do that. So I'm just putting the his individual pieces in the center because I think that looks better than all that horizontalness happening. <laughs> okay. And then when their new comeback happens, we'll figure out later what we're going to do with that because they're going to have two versions and I don't know it. And they better not surprise us like ATs did. Because we'll I'll fight. Um, and then next we have DKB. And I don't... I'll just take out the fillers, I guess. So I'm not like not too stressed about like figuring out their design or whatever. But I do have his... Um, love card to put away because i did find a trade for it even though i bought more versions so like who knows maybe i'll collect more members if i can find trades or whatever for their other cards because i do love all the members like a lot <laughs> like gk is just my main bias but like everyone else is like so so precious i would definitely want to get like yuku's card and i don't know maybe maybe um Daniel's card but for now we're just doing gk um and i hope they do one version albums forever because that will be so delightful 
One is, I think, is gonna stay like this because he has two cards and then he has two cards and then he has two cards. And then this is just random. Because I don't really want to collect my music taste because they suck. I really only collect Hong Jun's my music taste, so like, whatever. Because if I got my music taste card, it would fill out the page, but one is just really hard to collect. <laughs> it's really hard to collect for. Especially Raven. I just, I pick Raven because one, love him. Young Joe. And two, I pull him a lot. I didn't pull him in the newest album because, you know, I guess once I realized my Raven power, like the K-pop gods just had to take it away from me because they knew I would be too strong. Um, so they didn't pull him for the newest album. I also haven't like figured out how I'm going to arrange for that album, but it's also two cards. So like, I'll probably just keep doing like, like a six, like row six. on the back just so it doesn't throw off my sick my two 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 it's itsy and I think what I'm gonna do for this girl right here is do the two 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 because you always pull like two photo cards in one version. So, I usually just try to trade to whatever Rujin cards I can get. Um, so I think I'm just gonna do two, two, two for like whenever their comebacks are and such. I do have one of her cards to put away. And then I'll kind of just like arrange them based on like what she be looking like in them. And of course I have her postcard. Also I added her postcard from the version I got onto the back of this, this for this binder and and that's it y'all because the only other binder I have is ATs and like that's a whole nother story isn't it all right guys that is it for my video thank you so so much for watching me reorganize y'all when y'all voted on my little poll I put out y'all seemed very excited so I hope you enjoyed this video and um please come back and see me again and don't forget to like comment below and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video bye bye